had it running for like an hour and a half this morning. Gas burners, the only source of heat for many in day two of widespread power outages. Camping supplies have definitely come through. The ice storms cutting power for upwards of 300,000 people, according to OG&E. More than 24 hours without power, prompting neighbor to reach out to neighbor in panic. I woke up to my neighbor calling me because her power had gone out. She is an elderly lady, and uh, she was worried because her landline gets cut out whenever the power goes out, so, and her cell phone is currently dying. With a flood of outage reports, the website is down and phone lines are tied up. We just don't have estimated restoration times simply because the storm is still ongoing. David Kimmel with OG&E saying right now the company is prioritizing emergency response facilities like hospitals, police, and fire departments. Then we go to the circuits or the outages that have the highest number of outages, so get the most people back uh, restored uh, first. More than 1,700 crew members are on the road working to restore electricity as Oklahomans prepare for another night of freezing rainstorms. I try and find a propane heater or gas heater that I can use 